Anthony Davis than usual tonight as Darvin Ham told us that he is going to increase AD's minutes, including playing him the entire first quarter. As the Lakers have struggled mightily without AD and have been outscored by a significant margin when he's on the bench. Even when LeBron is on the floor without Davis, Los Angeles has had problems stopping the Grizzlies from attacking the basket. And I asked Desmond Bain how things change for him when AD is off the floor, and he told me, I'm aggressive regardless, but when he is off the floor, I'm going right at the rim. But they might not get that chance as AD, despite dealing with hip and foot injuries this series, says he's prepared to play all 48, quote, whatever minutes to get the job done, I'll be ready to do so. And we'll see what the Lakers need and can get out of their big man tonight, guys. And Cassidy, one key, that early first foul by Anthony Davis in this final seven minutes, because if you're going to play the first quarter in its entirety, you can't pick up number two here. Brooks on the drive. And that's going to be a push off. Tony Brothers saw Brooks extend that off arm and cause the foul. That's going to be his first. It has been a mistake to attack Anthony Davis because he has been absolutely brilliant defensively. And it has not mattered not who he's checking. He has sent everything back yeah. in the other direction. After the first two games, he had a total of 10 blocks. Russell's pass deflected. He turns it over. Bain on the break. Lays it home over Russell. There's that Memphis lethality in the open court. Lead down to three. Off the drag, it's Davis. And rebounded by Brooks. One and done that time by the Lakers. Brad staring down Reeves. Job blocked by Davis. Oh, he caught it and took his cornbread. What a play. James the trailer. Got it. Anthony Davis took it right out of Josh's shooting motion. Here's Bain. And Davis with the rebound. James on the break. Walks into the three. A little bit strong. LeBron James, folks, if you don't already know, showed up at 2.30 this afternoon to get a little early work in. Bain misfiring. Jackson with the offensive rebound. And here's LeBron. Anthony Davis at the rim denies Jaron Jackson. He is all over the place defensively. Had it knocked away to Reeves. Shot clock at 12 for the Lakers. Reeves sprays it out to James. Has his time for three. That one falls. It's the value of Austin Reeves being able to play pick and roll. And Davis made them change another shot. Blocked out of bounds. It'll stay at that end. Come on. I mean, this is consecutive possessions where Anthony Davis simply isn't having it. This is the spectacular block where he just takes it right from the shooting pocket and goes the other direction. Now Jaron Jackson has inside position. Mr. Davis says, not in my house. This guy, all five games, has given them great defense. This is what he's done against their best players. Nobody shooting above 35%. Incredible. He's established a no-fly zone in there, Doris. Tyus Jones checked into the ball game. His float game intimidated a little bit by Davis. And here comes Russell on the move with pace for three. And Rui Hashimura with a foul underneath going after the rebound. Lakers leading by eight. And if you're Darvin Ham, you have to be happy with the pace of the ball game so far. You have to be happy with the start defensively, obviously. I think for him, it's about getting back in transition and trying to make Memphis execute a half-court set. Grizzlies have misfired on their last seven consecutive shots. Lakers on a 14-2 run right now. Here's Moran. Loses Schroeder on the screen. Trying to go through Davis. And Morant going to be hit with a foul on the rebound attempt. And John having a conversation. Drawing with Tony Brothers. Morant with his first personal foul. 14 fouls for the Grizzlies. Hachimura. Schroeder left it short. And the Grizzlies on the run. And that's going to be a foul against LeBron out front before the shot. It'll be side out of bounds. James arguing that Morant initiated the contact. Well, Austin Reeves got a very brief respite because look at the bad floor balance on the drive by Schroeder. 
contact came very early. Okay, so can John just take off from anywhere in Duncan? I'm Apparently. His <laughs> after the whistle game is really impressive, too. Jones back out to Bain. Morant spins. Working against Schroeder. Good help. Over to Aldama. And Santi Aldama with his three sleeve on. A tremendous job. Again, Giles putting pressure on. It opens up that kick out pass. Ashimura and Russell, a little pistol action for the bucket. Lead back up to seven. James on the bench. D'Angelo off to a good start shooting the basketball. He's three for five. How big a difference does it make for the Lakers if he's scoring goals? Well, think about the game. He hits those three threes and totally changes the field. Reeves with the block. And Tillman puts it back.